Dave, considering all Cody's gone through this year, how good did you feel for him when he hit that? I, I feel great. Um, you know, even the day that he doesn't start to be excited to come in there and a double switch and do anything he can to help the ball club and for him to get rewarded like that and to reward us like that uh, was huge. And, and sometimes it's just that one at bat, one homer that can really get you going. So uh, love the at bats he's been taking, but certainly to, to walk a team off and we needed that, that win uh, considering where we were at with the pitching today. Um, certainly happy for him. Yeah. When's the last time you saw him grinning uh, ear to ear like that? You know, it's it's after the World Series win. Um, I, I think that for him, he expects a lot from himself. And um, to pick us up like that, as big as he did today, I think that, you know, you just feel – he feels good about himself and, and feels like he contributed on the offensive side. And so uh, it's good to see him smile. And what was your perspective on the Hayward home run foul ball? And what did the umpires tell you? They, uh, I was just happy that I, I thought it was foul. I was happy that they went back and re and kind of huddled up and said that the official call was foul. So for it to be overturned, um, it had to be very clear as opposed to the official fair home run call. Um, so I, I, I look back and they got it right, which is very fortunate. Thanks, Dave. Yep. Next questions from Fabiana Ardaya. Go ahead. Hey, Dave, I know you mentioned Cody has sort of looked good plate uh, since he's been back, but how do you feel about how he's looked in center? It seems like it hasn't really missed a beat. He has not missed a beat, and I think that people are quick to talk about the offense, but the defense, what he does for us in center field, just makes everybody around him better. So he hasn't missed a beat, to your point. And you mentioned you were kind of thin on pitching today. I mean, what was that conversation like with David before the game, just to see if he was ready to go back to back to back? Because obviously he doesn't yeah, quite just, just have talking, that. Just uh, Bardo talked to him and, and said he feels good. And so it's one of those situations it was going to be to get out of an inning. It uh, wasn't going to be an up and down. And uh, we felt we had a good run form right there. And he came up big. Uh, so to stay away from Victor, uh, Nelson, and Trina today, um, those guys, Bickford, uh, Joe, they came up big for us tonight. What did you think about uh, Julio's performance and how he sort of was attacking, sort of like you described he, before he the game? Was, he was fantastic. He was fantastic. Um, he and Will were very good together. Um, I, I thought that they sequenced, they got into counts the right way, they finished hitters the right way. Um, he was on the attack, and, and like I talked about earlier, it doesn't have to be just with the fastball. Uh, he was aggressive with his entire mix. Thanks, Dave. Next question is from Jorge Castillo. Go ahead. Uh, Dave, you mentioned Cody feeling like he's contributing. Um, is that how, how real is that? Someone, a guy who's been hurt and feel like maybe he's not like helping the team out and not part of the team. And how can this sort of shift maybe his mental approach to you know being here every day? It's it's big. It's real. Um, I, I think that we as coaches or teammates can say, "Hey, man, you know you're going to be there when you're ready to go." But as a player, you just feel like you want to pull your uh, weight, and so when he gets back you know, you're just kind of wanting to do so much, uh, again, to contribute. And so the work has been great. The defense has been great. Um, so for him to get that big hit, I think that uh, it was big for all of us. And uh, just how uh, impressive was uh, Phil Bickford uh, tonight? I mean, the three pitch inning. Phil, Phil was great. Um, you don't see too many three pitch innings in the big leagues, um, but his, uh, his willingness and eagerness to take the baseball um, and pitch big innings, regardless of, you know, when the spot is, is, is incredible. His gratitude for being a big league ball player, playing for the Dodgers, his hometown team is next level. And uh, he, he's just been a complete joy for all of us. And that was Joseph Kelly who showed up today? That was Joseph. Joseph was uh, painting the glove side uh, heater down and away. That was Joseph. Thank you, Dave.